Greetings, mortals, to Umbra, Amulet of Light. I am back. We're in the new location over at my friend's place. We're chilling here until we all move in together somewhere else, because she's only got so long that she can be here. Could be in a couple months, could be in a couple years, who knows. Um, I've got all my cats, all three of them, Sasha, Claire, and Void. It's awesome. And I get to live with a bunch of other cats, because our friend's got cats as well. And there's also a dog, and a possum, it's, it's, it's awesome. And, there, and Claire had kittens, so that's a thing now. They're going to go off on their own adventures as soon as they're big enough, though. And you can't tell them the cute little bumper car fuzzballs. So, I'm back! Alright, let's get into this. This is Early Access in the App Store. For hundreds of years, the world, the balance was kept by mysterious block formations scattered throughout. But everything changed when a new dark wizard, the dark wizard, summoned strong shot to break the and scatter the block formation, causing it. only those who who own the magical umber they want to seek help. Even in the, uh, okay, developers, make that go by just a little bit less quickly. If you hear noise in the background, that's the cats messing with one another. Void's got to be in a crate for medical reasons right now. Welcome, Amulet Bearer. My name is... K? How do you pronounce that? Kiai. My name is Kiai. <laughs> I don't know. We need you to undo the Dark Wizard's a action and bring back balance to the world. Only you who could match the block shadow to the light pattern on the wall. Tap and drag the block to move it. Okay. Oh. Okay. That's just shadow play. Where are you going? Go right, right there. Okay. And then you right there. You can double tap a block to rotate it. Symbol on the block show the symbol on the block show its pivot point. Is this one solid block? Double tap. Double tap. Hello. Double tap. Double tap. Double. Am I? Am I not doing this right? Double. Either my phone can't handle this, or that's a bug that they need to fix. But either way, I guess this particular playthrough is ended. So, the next game. Alright, welcome to Paths Beatrice's Adventure. This is also early access. Looks like Prologue and Chapter 1 are free. Tap to close this message. Yes. Let me in. Swipe to unlock. What the? Every choice you make in this game has an impact on the story. Be careful, your path might be longer or shorter according to your choices. Am I actually going to play? 
it's Beatrice's birthday. She is turning 16. She and her family are gathered in her li grandparents' living room to celebrate. She doesn't seem very happy. She is unwrapping her gifts willingly. Let me finish reading, good lord. And there's a family picture right there where they look like they're having a good time. And Grandpa says, come on, open it. Let's see what Grandpa came up with this time. Dad, I seriously hope it's nothing like the last one. Tom and Nicholas made a mess with it. It took hours. It took the housekeeper three hours to clean up. What was it? Was it a chemistry set? Those are cool. Yeah, a homemade one. Oh dear. <laughs> I guess I'm just in my seat. Beatrice rolls her eyes. Will it ever? Will it ever come a day a conversation won't end up in being about the evil spawn? Well, the only way to find out is opening it. So Beatrice opens the present. It's a novel, The Whispers. Oh, thank God! It's just a book. Nothing that might explode or melt or worse. Although I'm not sure B will know what to do with it. Okay. Tap here to go faster or scroll down. What what am I supposed to do? Oh. Okay, so I can either be direct or sarcastic. I'm going to go direct. I'm not an idiot. Because I'm not. I know how to read. Type on character's avatar. Well, anyway. Thank you, Grandpa. It's, um, interesting. A little bit old school, but okay. I'm going to say interesting. I want to read it. Yay, made Grandpa happy. I know you like to read on your smartphone. Smartphones are great. I like to read on my smartphone, too. I think there's always something romantic about an actual book you can hold. Absolutely. I agree with that. Grandpa, we have many books. There's a, there's a spot on my phone that's right right there. So. <laughs> yes, tons and tons of them. I'm going to be getting a, a new phone soon. We love reading. Reading is the key to success. Well said, Nick. I know, darlings. You are so clever. Aren't they? Every time I come back home, I find them busy learning something new. They're so curious about everything. I wish Bay was more like... Tom, I guess? Or... Or more like that. That's impossible, Mom. I don't think she can do much more than staring at her phone. Mom seems amused. She gives Tommy a small smirk. Is this a chat thread or like? Don't be too hard on her, Tommy. Not everyone can be as smart as you. And of course, they take the spotlight. And B's public shaming begins. Dang. Even today. On my 16th birthday. Hey, don't forget, it's Beatrice's special day today. Grandma looks at Beatrice and smiles, understanding. I think someone's on the ball. Here, my love, open this. What is it? Let me see. Ooh. Ordinary Potter, you can use that to go back in time. Beatrice opens a present. It's a necklace with a pendant shaped like an hourglass. Wow, Grandma, it's... Oh, I can, I can choose. 
I think it's amazing. That is a really pretty thing. I want one. That made Grandma happy. Come on, wear it. Yeah, put that on. I know I would. B tries it on. I'm glad you liked it. It's a beautiful necklace. I think I've seen that pendant before. You probably did, yes. It used to be mine. But I think it's time for B to have it. To remind her she's always in my heart and in my thoughts. That's poetic. Is this going to be anything but text message conversations? I wonder why I never got that kind of gift from you. You wouldn't have appreciated it. She got you there. You've always been a little bit more... I get to choose what Grandma says now? That's, that's, a, that's a color heartless. My god. Materialistic, I guess, for lack of a better option. That's what I was saying. Be Mom don't want to hear it. You're not really into sentimental stuff, Mom. You're more pragmatic. <laughs> Thank you, B. That's exactly what I mean. Never meant. Sorry. Anyways, I arranged the guest rooms for you. you. Better not travel back home in this weather. It's dangerous to drive when it's so snowy and foggy. Thank you, Charlotte. That's a great idea. Since when does a guy agree to stay at his mother-in-law's place? Cool! A sleepover party! But hey, since we've talked about gifts, isn't it time to, to give us something for our... Re reports? We've earned it! Tommy, we've already given you that video game you want. I wanted or liked. Yes, but this year I got an A plus in history. Hey! I got one as well in math. Oh, come on, everybody knows history is way more important than math. Are you, you're, are you kidding, right? Oh gosh, who cares? Are they really this desperate for attention? Guys. Every subject is important. You must try to be the best in each of them. So you have many paths to choose. I always preferred math. Exactly the point I was not trying to get to. Curl? Okay. Okay, so Dad's on my team. And so is Grandma. I'm sure? Yeah. And Grandpa's on mine. He was a literature professor, after all. What do you think? Which one is better? <sighs> if I were to have to choose one, I personally would go with history being more important. 
Like math is incredibly important as well. Don't get me wrong. I I think I personally think they're both equally important. If I had to choose one, the, those who don't know history are doomed to repeat it. And certain things should not be forgotten. So history. I've got an achievement. Historian soul. Made my brother happy. And I broke my other one's heart. And you can't be serious, right? Why do you always defend him? I, I don't even know him! <laughs> no, I defend myself. It's my birthday. Let me choose what subject I like on my birthday. You two are ruining it. Darn straight. No pipe down. It's my day. What? I'm typical. You got something to say? You played the victim card, didn't you? What the f- It's my birthday! Why can't you leave your little brothers alone? Are you even capable of sharing the spotlight for just a minute? Yes, I am. That's my day. Mom, I'm only 16. I don't get very many more birthdays that I can actually enjoy. Once I hit 21, it's all downhill from there. It's all getting older from there. So let me enjoy this. <laughs> yes, I am. It's my day because it's never just a minute. It's all day, every day. You can't stop yourself from reminding me constantly of how exceptional they are. Even today. Then maybe you should try to improve yourself instead of wasting time and energy being resentful and jealous. Well, maybe you should shut the hell up on your daughter's birthday. Quit ragging on her about how useless she is when it's her birthday. Your brothers are focused. It's not a fault. It's a merit. I used to be the same. For some of us, life is a little bit more than parties and, and I can't read that the spots over it. Selfies. Oh, go. What's wrong with that? I'm 16. I'm not taking selfies myself, but what's wrong with... Ugh. Never look at the bigger picture. What's wrong with her enjoying herself on her birthday? Sometimes it seems like your brothers are more mature than you are. At least they have interests. Being 16 doesn't mean you get to be a frivolous person. This is like the worst birthday ever. Seems to me you have no clue about what you want to do in life. I still have no clue about what I want to do in life, and I'm in my 30s! She seemed to have found her life goal. Don't start again with... I'm bringing hockey up again, yes, Beatrice. Hey, if you want to do hockey, you do hockey. You go out and be a famous hockey player. You're quite a good athlete, and you quit. And whose fault is that? Yours, of course. You can't handle competition. You're weak. No, F you! No, you are. You feel the need to terrorize people. Look at those two.
You don't have sons. You have obedient minions. We're not. You're just being mean, as usual. Being mean is all is all you is all you can. I don't know what it's, it's under the spot. It's all you can do. Please, let's stop this. Thank you, Grandma. I swear you're the only voice of reason in this household. We're here to celebrate, not to fight. There's nothing to celebrate. Those two always ruin everything. Your mom probably didn't help it much. And you all let them. Beatrice, are you listening to yourself? You're overreacting as usual. Couldn't you be kind to your brothers for a change? I feel like both of these are sarcastic. This is getting incredibly boring very fast. So, so proud of the fact that they're the geniuses of the family, and I'm, you know what? I'm just gonna cut that here. On to the on to the to the next game, I guess. Hope you enjoyed this one. Once upon a time, in space. Swipe here to move. I have forgotten what this game is called. Let me move that. Whoa. Collect stars. Well, oh, ah, ah! Okay. Hope I'm not supposed to get all of them. Stars, increase your score. The big ones. Avoid hazards. What are hazards? Whoa, that's a hazard. So, am I a fish in space? Ah, that's a big hazard. Big hazard. Okay, not so big. Big hazard. Little hazard. Whoa! Moving hazards! This is really pretty. Ah! Ah! Dang! I don't think I could have... I don't think I could have avoided that. Cosmic clam. <laughs> I like him. I like him. <laughs> Neptune's barnacles. A starfish. Are you lost? Don't worry, you're safe here in the sanctuary. Say, if you're looking for your friends, maybe I can help. Gather me some shells and I'll show you something incredible. Oh, okay. Collect five shells. Oh, give me that. Uh, big hazard. Star, star, stars, star, star, stars, stars. Ah! Give me that. Give me that. Yeah. Give that. No, I missed it. That's a big hazard. Ooh, what are you? Give me that. So that's two times the points. Whoa! What just shot at me? Oh, gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give oh, I got... Is that... It's single use. Okay, I wasted that for science. Me? How many do I need? Like, how many do I have left? Is that the last one? 
Okay. Oh no, there was that. There was another one. Eh! <laughs> I almost got hit by that one. Whoa! Okay, okay, okay. This is actually really fun. Okay, surely. Oh, okay, there's a there's a number up there. I didn't see that. And I'm dead. All right, clam. Here's your seven shells. Collect five shells. Blazing quasars. You found some shells. Hmm, I think we'll need a few more. Maybe I can help. Cosmic Clam is ready to open. Choose a pearl. Hmm. Me. 200 shells. That's a lot of shells. Wonder what we're under the other two. That should be enough. Now watch out, something cosmic is about to happen. Indeed. Okay. Behold, the Price Cano. The oh, like Volcano. Price Cano, okay. You can use the shells to activate it. Try it out. Okay. I buy 200 shells. Uh, pinball? I got the green guy. And now we're getting sucked into a black hole. Awesome. Um, what does this mean for me? Toddle. Ancestor, green sea turtle. Turtle. This turtle loves swimming in tropical seas. After traveling very long distances, they return to the same beach where they were born on to lay their own eggs. I've been to turtle egg releases before. That's it's awesome. And it's got to be done real early in the morning, but it's worth it. Pluto scallops, you found another starfish? It's a star turtle. Let's have a look. Tap your album to view your starfish. Give you other starfish sets with these buttons. Okay. Welcome to the sanctuary, little one. It's not much of a home right now. But sometimes I dream what this place could become. Pretty. Perhaps someday my dream will come true. Okay. So, do I just complete five star chains? I'm not sure what exactly that's supposed to mean. Ah! I did not avoid that in time. Can I be this one again? I think it's turtles, but I just I happen to enjoy the fish. It's pretty. Oh, no, 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 okay. Am I still getting star chains? Like, what, what, what exactly does that entail? Me! A shell. Whoa! 
to find the camera. Oh, dang it. <laughs> what? Ah, dang it. I shouldn't have gone over there. One shell. Cosmic Gateway. What's this? You're taking selfies now. Your album sounds like the perfect spot for it. <sighs> cool. Tap a star first. I, 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 I'm good. Alright. You know, they say that once you discover a place, it will be much easier to find it again. Not always true, actually. Um, let's go one more round. Just keep swimming off in space. Is it swimming if it's in space? How does this thing, like, live? Primordial. Whoa! 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 Well, that happened. I hope you enjoyed this episode, and I will see you in the next one. <laughs>